Okay, so week three of Nogi Butterfly Guard. Let's look at some more um, things that can happen. So again, I'm playing my seated butterfly guard. Keeps trying to get me on my back, tries to reach my feet. My hands are in front. Tries to push on my shoulders. And we're hand fighting from here. <clears throat> Everything so far has been based on my opponent being on his knees. But now, and me trying to win the underhook. But now Kane's changing the game because he goes to combat base this time and puts one foot up. Okay, so from this position, very hard for me to win an underhook on the side of the leg that's up. <clears throat> so we're going to transition to a two-on-one. So from here, my right hand is going to make a cross grip on Kane's wrist. My left hand finds the back of the elbow. And nothing changes. Okay, what's my goal? I want to get my hips under his hips. So I scoop my foot in, and I'm going to use my right butterfly hook just to launch Kane onto his right side. The second I do, I, win, I get hip to hip. I win the underhook. I'm in the side control. Yeah? So, <clears throat> just go to combat base again. Anytime your, your partner's in combat base, okay, the side that the, that the foot is down is, there's a weakness in that, in that position because he's no base on this side. He's got good base on the planted foot. So anytime he goes to combat base, this is the perfect time for me to hit that butterfly guard sweep. Again, um, the only thing Kane can do is post with his right hand, so I want to make sure I can tie that up with a two-on-one. I can make the grip um, behind, uh, underneath the wrist, or I can make it over the top, whatever personal preference it is. The minute I make this nip grip, and again, it's with a, it's a C grip, it's not a, a monkey grip, because I have more control in both directions. Um, same thing applies. It's very hard for me to um, butterfly sweep Kane from this position. Because my hips aren't close enough to his. So I'm going to butt scoop in. Now he's no base on this side. So as I fall on my left side, I just kick my leg over and put him on his back. The battle is now who's coming up on top. So I want to get my hip on his hip and I'm looking to win that underhook as quickly as I can. So one more time on that. So maybe it originally started off when you're uh, on, um, no, no, you're on your knees. It originally started off, your partner was on your knees, he's trying to pick up my feet, my hands are protecting my feet, trying to push on my shoulders, I'm here. Now he changes the game, okay? He switches to combat base and plants the foot on the mat. Immediately I'm looking for this two-on-one, okay? Whether it's under the wrist or over the wrist, doesn't matter, whatever is comfortable. And now I butt scoop in. As I fall on my side, he has no base on this side. So as I launch him, I win that underhook straight away and get hip to hip. Um, the biggest problem with this is obviously the battle of getting the underhook. So um, this time Keane's playing butterfly guards, he's on his butt. He's protecting his feet. No, he's not. So again, he makes sure his hands, he's protecting his feet. What do I want to do? I want to get him on his back. I try to push on his shoulders, his hands are engaging. But now I switch the game and I decide to go to combat base, okay, which can set up a few of my passes. He immediately makes his two on one, but notice where his hips are. They're far too far back, so he's going to put scoop in. That may take several butts. He keeps this leg on the inside. And now from there, I have no base on this side. So from this position, as he hits his butterfly guard sweep, a thing that can happen is I can roll keep your grip, and get to the knees. So the minute you put the person on the side, you have to fill that space. Okay, so one more time. Um, you and your knees. Get on my back. Put my feet. Pushing my shoulders. This goes to combat base. I immediately get that two on one. I put scoop in. And the minute I sweep him, I'm looking to win that underhook and may get my hip on his hip. And then we'll just control. 